He made me feel like I never wrestled. He made me feel like I never grappled. Like, and it wasn't like he just overpowered me and there was nothing I could do. He outworked me, out technique. Like, he's just that good, man. And people don't get it. Three, two, three. Yeah, yeah. It happened to be sparring day. And, you know, we all line up. We have, like, almost a team huddle. We're sitting there, like, this is who's fighting, da 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 And I was like, hey, guys, like, DC and Luis know me. Uh, my name's Joe Gennetti. I was on the show with them. Um, I'm going to be here for a month. Love to work with everybody. I'm here to learn from everybody. Um, and they were like, he's getting ready for Conor McGregor. Javier Mendez was like, okay, we need long, tall lefties. And he's scanning the room, and I'm like, oh, no. And he's like, Joe, are you going with Habib? And I'm like, I don't even know him. They're like, yeah, but you're long and tall, and you're a lefty. I'm like, all right. So my first day there, they're like, you're going to help him get ready for Conor McGregor. And I'm like, I mean, I, my stand-up's not like Conor's, but I'll try. And I went with him. First round of the day, we did MMA. And in my head, I'm like, all right, like, obviously I'm not going to get the better of him, but I'm going to try and be a good teammate and fight like Conor. So everything I did was to set up that left hand. I did not land a left hand on him. Like, he, I couldn't touch him. And I'm sitting there. He kind of moves like, you know, Mike Tyson did, like this stuff. But I knew that, and I'm like, okay, he goes left, right, left, right. When he comes back to the right, I'm going to clap him. Through my left hand, he was under it, shooting on my legs. And I'm like, oh no, here we go. And I actually shoved his head, and I got him below my knee. And I was like, this is it. I'm going to stop the takedown. I got his head below my knee, and I pulled my foot up. And I was like, that's it, I'm free. Bang, he was on my other leg. Now I'm fighting off this leg, and I'm like, uh-oh, I wasn't ready for that. Then he's on a double leg. Then he climbs up my back, and he's got my arm trapped. He picks me up, launches me through the air. And as I'm flying through the air, I'm like, yeah, I was waiting for that. And then he was just, he was stuck on me. His hip pressure, how he could just squeeze. It wasn't like raw strength, it was technique. And like, you could tell, he wasn't exerting himself. He wasn't, like he whooped my ass, he wasn't trying. He was just, you know, he's holding me really tight. He'd posture up, a couple good punches, he's back down low. And I'm sitting there going, this guy's going maybe 40%. And I'm trying as hard as I can to shrimp out. Can't get his knees off of me. It was crazy. I did three rounds with him that day. I was exhausted. I wanted to throw up. I've never, never in my life thrown up from training, ever, no matter how hard I've trained. Wanted to throw up. But yeah, it was, that was my first day at AKA. First day, you're helping Habib get ready for Conor McGregor. And I was like, you're joking, right? I'm already this nervous. Yeah, I'm a shy person. So you know, like, hi, I'm Joe. Like, nice to meet you, nice to meet you. But yeah, they were like, get in there with him. And, uh, he was one of, if not the most humble guys I've ever met. He's walking by, he's thanking me for the rounds. End of the day, we're leaving the gym. Thank you, brother, thank you for the work. I'm like, thank me? I was like, I'm a nobody, thank you. Like, you're the champ. And he's like, no, no, thank you for the work. I appreciate it. you helped me a lot. And I'm like, what? Like, dude, you, like, okay. And, but like, every time we train together, thank you, thank you, I really appreciate it. I'm like, why do you appreciate me? I appreciate you. Like, but that's just his mindset. Like, some people just like, they think it's like almost, some people think it's an act, I don't know why, and some people just don't believe it, but he is just genuinely humble, has his ethics, he follows them. It was just crazy, it was almost weird because you don't meet people that humble, you know? Like, I'm a very outspoken person at times, but I try to keep it humble. He is a new level of humble. Like, just thanks everybody. Like, like I said, that was my first day. He didn't know me through a hole in the wall. Did three rounds with him, he, oh, thank you, thank you. I was like, that's the reason he's a champ.